Well, hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Miss Crochet and Coffee here. And today we have a Diamond Art Club unboxing. But this isn't just any old un unboxing. This was supposed to be my sneak peek for Friday, but things happen and, you know, it didn't get here in time. But that's okay, because I can unbox it for you now. So yay! Who's excited? I'm excited. So let's get into it, shall we? We have our knife and we're going to do a little movie magic. There we go. Safety first. So as you can tell, it's in one of the new boxes, which you know what that means. If you see the blue or purple strip, that means it's a square. So what image did they bless us with this week? So again, thank you to the folks over at Diamond Art Club for providing this for us. I greatly appreciate it. So let's see what we got. This is from a new artist and her name will pop up right on the screen for you. Um, this is a... 51 by 61 centimeter. It is square with ABs. I love it so much. I love it, you guys. When I've seen it, it is going in my future craft room. I don't care what anybody has to say about it. I love this little image. It is called Glitter Everything Unicorn. Ah, look how cute she is. Ah. So let's get into it, folks. I hope you're having a wonderful, wonderful day. So we're going to pull all the stuff out. There we go. There we go. We can get rid of that box. So what do we have? We have our basic toolkit. Now, again, if you got an older image, you will not get tweezers in your toolkit. So in a toolkit, if you've never seen one from Diamond Art Club, you got the blue squishy, you got some baggies, you got a, a clear boat with a funnel. You have two plates of wax, your pen, and a pair of tweezers. That's how you know it's square. Here is the schematic. Oh, my God. She only has 21 colors. Look how cute she is. Oh my gosh, she's so freaking cute. And I know a lot of y'all are probably saying, but Miss Coffee, why wouldn't you give that to Maggie? Look here, look, listen, listen. Why does she get all the good stuff and I don't get anything, okay? This is mine. Why is it mine? Because I don't really want this type of stuff in my daughter's room because she already has enough of a vocabulary. Anyways, so if you don't know, it says glitter. I sprinkle that shit on everything. Yeah! Now, seeing as how in my house, my husband hates glitter with a fiery passion of hell, um, this is the next best thing, so yes! Isn't she cute? Now, okay, we're gonna get into this. We're gonna get into it. Get, get out of here. We're gonna get into this. So let's see what we got going on here. And of course, it's like pink everywhere. Pink all the things. Oh, hold on. Okay, so we got... It's not super big, so it's not going to take me any time at all to do this. It is confetti heavy, which glitter kind of, you know, glitter, confetti, you know, that fun stuff. All right, so we're going to roll it the other way. You do get some of that parchment paper that you guys love so much for it. It is a bigger sheet of parchment paper, which I think that would cover the whole thing. You got that paper that tells you how to dawn paint. Um, you got your drills. Look at all the pink lusciousness. <gasps> So let's take a look at the canvas. Oh my gosh, she's adorable. Okay, so she is a little pink unicorn and I was worried about the work. I'm not gonna lie, not everything in glitter, but I sprinkled that shit on because of the fact that it's smaller, it's a smaller font. I was worried it wasn't gonna come out okay, but if you look at the rendering that they have online, which I'll put up here, uh, it actually looks really good. So that's what the picture's supposed to look like. That's, that's the picture. And then you have the, the rendering. And then you have the actual canvas. <gasps> oh my God, I'm so excited. She's a little unicorn. So she has her little unicorn horn here. And you can see her little floppy ears and her pink hair. She has some wingalings. You know, you you just know Miss Coffee's going to enhance this with her own little, you know that, right? You, you know this, you know this. So she also has a little cute butterfly on the end over here. Look at her little hoops. Oh my goodness. And she has like some little barrettes and stuff in her hair. And there's her unicorn horn right in between the G and L and glitter. So, yes. This here is all color blocking. All that is color blocking. All of this at the bottom is color blocking minus the words. The rest of it is like sprinkle, just a little, little sprinkle of confetti in there. So, yes. I absolutely love it. Let's get a closer look. Again, she only has 21 colors. She is freaking adorable. Oh, my goodness. Yes. So. There's our schematic again. Let's look at the clarity of the symbols. Oh my God, she's so cute. I just love her. I think this might be my next one. <laughs> I have to, you guys. Look how cute she is. 
they're always your next one, right? Whenever you unbox a diamond painting, you're like, this is going to be my next one. And then you get another diamond. This one's going to be my next one. Yo, oh, yeah, I don't care if you don't like the noise. <laughs> there we go. So, we have 21 cut. Look at the pinks. Look at all the pinks. All right. So, we have a couple of bags of, I think it's 605. I hope it's 605. It looks like 605. Does it look like 605 to y'all? Let's look at the, 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 the drill. Let's just flip them over. Look at them. Now, you're seeing these in natural light, so no funny business here. So, they look really, really good. As you guys know, Diamond Art Club is always improving on their drill quality, and they did have a little hiccup in their drills there for a little bit, but they look good now. Not seeing any little knobbly bits or dimples or anything in these drills. They look great. Good job, Diamond Art Club. All right. So we got a bunch of 605 there, which I'm going to guess is the background because then we have some more. six. You're living a 605 life here. So if you're a pink lover, this canvas is for you. This canvas is just throwing up with pink. Oh, my God. 3608. We are not practicing social distancing in there. 5200, which I guess would go in the letters, huh? Another bag of 5200. That was a short strip. And then this last strip. 3609. Eh, eh, AB alert. Two bags. We got double trouble. 141. Yes. All right. So if you don't know what an AB is, if you're new to the game, you don't know what AB is. AB stands for Aurora Borealis. That is an iridescent coating that is put on top of the drills to make them sparkle just a little bit brighter. Kind of reminds you of the northern lights, I mean, or like a rainbow. So if you can see that that rainbowy, shimmery stuff that's happening there in those bags, you see all that, that color dancing around in there, that is the AB coating on the drills. Um, so this is a normal drill and they're sparkle. They just sparkle like a white color. Like, oh, look, sparkly. But bam! These are the little bit extra that Diamond Art Club puts in there to make their canvases sparkle just a little bit brighter. Do what makes you sparkle. Yes, double trouble. Now, I haven't seen this many ABs in a long time, so we're going to have to figure out where these bad boys go. This is for number two, which is 141, so outlining this butterfly, outlining the entire rain. The, oh, my God, the entire horse is outlined, or the entire unicorn is outlined in twos. Her face her eyes, her wit. Oh my God, Diamond Art Club. Y'all were not stingy with the ABs on this one. Good God. So let's see. We don't have any in the word. They're sprinkled all throughout the sides over here. So these one little spots of white you see are all AB. Oh my God, you guys. This thing is going to sparkle like nobody's business. Holy moly. This entire heart here, heart up here, all the little embellishments in her hair, her entire horn is outlined in ABs. Again, all around her, this... The uh, fleckles of white you see, not the big ones, but the small fleckles of white you see. Let me bring it up so you can see it. See all those little fleckles? All those number twos? Those are all ABs. They were not stingy with the ABs. Y'all talk about Diamond Art Club don't listen. Diamond Art Club be listening. They don't tell y'all nothing. They listen to everything. So they have ABs all. This canvas, you guys, this canvas, good God. All right. So we got those. Let's see what else colors we got. We got 718. Ooh, I like that color. That's a cute color. 3607. This is definitely the next one. 3607. 603. We got a watermelon. We got the seedless watermelon right there. We got that seedless watermelon right there. 819. 963. 3837. Eh, eh. My God, I've never, what the hell? No, what? Whoa, whoa, whoa. They just snatched the wig straight off my scalp. 124 is a pink AB. Now, I have seen pink ABs, but they're like the powder pink. I've never seen a pink AB like this before. This is like Barbie Dreamhouse with Ken attachments included pink. Oh my God, where does this go now? Like, they didn't have enough ABs in here. They're like, nah, you said we were, yeah, you said in the last unboxings that we were being stingy with the ABs. Now you're getting them all over the place. So let's see where this goes. Number one is for this AB. So number one is in the highlights of her tail and her mane here all the way up, all the way down over here. You have more number ones up on the outline of her hair up here as well. I don't think you have any in her legs. So I think it's mostly her hair as highlights. So you have the hair here, 
all up here and in the tail. Let's bring it up so you guys can see this. Oh my God, Diamond Art Club, y'all is killing it with these ABs. So there's some number ones right there. Number ones right there. There's some more number ones and some more number ones. And then some more right there on her tail. Yes, I mean, I saw, like, they is not playing. They is snatching all the wigs, all the wigs. That is the prettiest AB color I have seen. And of course, they're not practicing social distancing. I seen you in there. I seen you. You're trying to hide, but I see you. The bag is see-through. I can see you. Oh my gosh, I'll tell you, these people. 124, 3371. Where, where in the hell is that going? Oh, I guess her eyelids. I'm gonna say, uh, that's a chocolate brown, if you didn't know. It looks black on camera. Looks black in real life, too. But it, it's a third, it's a, a dark chocolate brown. 208. It's like Laffy Taffy. 917. 3799. 327. 915. Oh, I love that deep pink. And 209. 210. See, I like how those two colors right there, 210 and, uh, no, 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 don't, no, focus on it. 210 and 209, they're like the, like lighter shades of each other. You'll get some colors that are like complete ball fill out of the range. Um, and then you got 814. So that is all the colors in this kit. Yes. So those are the colors in Glitter Everything Unicorn. So I'm not sure at the time of recording this, I think there were still some copies of this image left. So if you didn't get it because you were unsure of what it would look like and you have now made up your mind, you might be able to still be able to snag it. I'm not 100% sure it'll pop up on the screen for you. But yes, this was supposed to be my sneak peek for last week. But you know, shit happens. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new to the channel and would like to see more random crazy videos just like this one, please feel free to hit that subscribe button and the bell to be notified anytime I randomly decide to put up a video. And believe me, it's random. But with that said, folks, I must now bid you adieu. But not before reminding you, like I always try to, to be kind, be courteous, be cool. Bye, guys!